Why are there not more people talking about the last witch burning in Ireland? This story is not just a relic of ancient history, it happened just over a century ago, in a time that feels both distant and eerily close. The tale of Bridget Cleary is a chilling reminder of how superstition and fear can lead to unimaginable horrors. Born in 1869, Bridget was known for her beauty, intelligence, and independence traits that made her stand out in her small Irish village. She was a modern woman in many ways, a dressmaker who also kept hens, and she was well liked by those who knew her. But in 1895, her life took a dark and tragic turn. After falling ill with what was likely bronchitis, her husband, Michael Cleary, became convinced that she was not his wife, but a fairy changeling. This belief was rooted in deep-seated Irish folklore, where it was thought that fairies could abduct humans and leave a changeling in their place. Michael's conviction grew stronger as Bridget's condition worsened. He sought the help of local herbalists and wise men who provided him with various remedies and rituals to expel the supposed fairy spirit. The community, gripped by fear and superstition, supported these actions, believing they were necessary to save Bridget. Over the course of several days, Michael and several others tortured Bridget in a horrifying attempt to bring back his real wife. They forced her to consume herbal concoctions, subjected her to brutal rituals, and eventually set her on fire. The chilling part? Michael genuinely believed he was saving her. The community's involvement in Bridget's torture and death highlights the pervasive power of superstition. In the grip of fear, they thought the only way to rescue Bridget from the fairies was by destroying the changeling. This tragic event is a stark reminder of the dangers of ignorance and the destructive power of superstition. Bridget's story did not end with her death. The aftermath saw a trial that gripped the nation. Eleven people were tried for their involvement in her death, including her husband Michael. The trial revealed the extent of the community's belief in fairies and the lengths they would go to in their attempts to combat what they perceived as supernatural threats. The court proceedings were a mix of horror and disbelief as the modern world grappled with the reality of such a brutal act driven by ancient beliefs. The trial was widely covered in the media, bringing to light the dark underbelly of rural Irish life and the dangers of unchecked superstition. Bridget Cleary's tragic story is a stark reminder of the dangers of ignorance and the destructive power of superstition. Her death was not just a personal tragedy, but a societal one, reflecting the deep-seated fears and beliefs that could lead to such an unspeakable act. In the end, the memory of Bridget Cleary lingers as a haunting echo of a bygone era. Her story is a somber testament to a time when fear and myth could lead to unspeakable tragedy. It serves as a cautionary tale, reminding us of the importance of reason and compassion in the face of fear and ignorance. So, next time you hear a tale of fairies and folklore, remember Bridget Cleary, the last witch burning in Ireland. Her story is not just a piece of history, but a powerful reminder of the human capacity for both cruelty and belief. It urges us to question our own beliefs and the ways in which they shape our actions. Bridget Cleary's tragic story is a stark reminder of the dangers of ignorance and the destructive power of superstition. In the end, 11 people were tried for their involvement in her death, but the memory of Bridget Cleary lingers as a haunting echo of a bygone era. Her story is a somber testament to a time when fear and myth could lead to unspeakable tragedy.